55-gallon tank. Uh, we get these stickers for 55-gallon drums, but uh, that's the product. Chevy drive train. That's say 10 weight. So that's pretty thin. It's a very clear fluid, hydraulic fluid that they run in these trucks. How much horsepower does this putty tad have? No horses, it runs off a cat. <laughs> runs off a cat. You see that? Got 225,000 kitty cats up in there running. This. I thought I seen a putty cat. I did, I did. Look at this putty tat, guys. There's just a tanker just to fill up some of these trucks out in the field. So some of them don't even have to come in, or is that a water truck? I'll have to ask. That could be a water. Of course, we've got a service truck here. So, kids, you want to play with the Tonka toys? How would you like to play with this Tonka toy? Food for the day. He's done with his shift. He swept the floorboard out. He's uh, cleaned it up, parked it there for the next guy to come along and jump in that baby and take off. Poor Joe Trucker. Are you going to fill her up for the next guy? Somebody's walked. Yeah. Probably kids has come out here and just literally walked <laughs> up into the top of these. Okay, it actually okay, looks like sand. In there a while, see how it's layered over there? Yeah, the wind has layered that like a side of a mountain. And it's all gravel that's been uh, processed out here in conveyor belts and such. It's granite that's what and rock in mixed right together. Here. Yeah, that's what I need in my driveway. I can uh, just level the top of that off, and I would never have to worry about rocking it ever again. You'd have to buy a shitload of tires, though. Yeah, the, the chains tires, on though. the front of the uh, dump truck, $36,000 for a set, lasts a year and a half, and on the front tires, so that the rock doesn't cut the tires on that eight-foot rubber tire. What they got this berm along this hot road for? The Oklahoma Drilling Company. Them are all oil drilling rigs. How many derricks can you count? 